What is up guys? It's Fanboy from Super Lego Fanboy and today we got another Lego Ninjago Legacy set review. This is set number 71736 ages 8 and up. This is the Boulder Blaster. It has 449 pieces. It comes with 4 minifigures. One of them is a limited edition golden ninja. Looks like a little like target practice and of course the blaster. Before we take a look at set, look at the box artwork. This looks so far impressive. So, and you see, she says right here, featured in season four. Here are the figures you get with, including the ten Ninjago gears, limited edition Golden Kai, which is very nice. Um, the figures are. Well, I said, like I just said before, we get Kai Legacy, Cole, Lloyd, and Izor. And of course, there's an actual size scale of a, one of the one of the figures. If we flip it around, here's the back of the box. Uh, here's everything it could do, the features, and looks like you can actually. Looks like you can hit that target, I think. As you may know, I am still on the hunt for all six Golden Ninjas. I almost have all of them. All I'm looking for is the Fire Dragon attack, which has a limited distance Golden Nia figure. So, stay tuned for that, guys. I'll try to get as soon as I can. And there are some actual scenes from Season 4. And, it's like I said... Featured in season four, and there they are the scenes. Uh, if we get to the side, there's a nice picture of Kai right there. Uh, anyway, so let's get on to the view of that Boulder Blaster. Let me zoom in a little better. We'll, we'll move the some of the stuff out of the way. And so here is the Boulder Blaster. Right off the bat, I am so impressed how this thing looks like. Sadly, I do not have the original one, but I think it's pretty much identical to it. Uh, in the short, it's actually called a. Looks like it's inspired by like some kind of a roto jet. I heard. And here's some funny things. Right here, they're using pistols, I think. Uh, this cockpit is brand new for a Ninjago. You can actually lift this up and actually put your figure in there. Yeah. This is... Well, uh, so, these are... These are real big stickers right here. Uh, actually, these are... Both of these are actually kind of big. Uh, these are, this is a sticker that's not printed. Uh, both of them are. Looks like we got some more pistols uh, back here. Looks like it's just those uh, blade pieces as we saw in the Zane's Titan Battle Mech, the Legacy version. I had viewed that one, so you can check this, check it out after this video if you want to. Looks like you got some orange and sand green highlights with some gold you know, I'm saving the best part of this set so stay tuned for that whoops man let me tell you this area where the uh, sp spring loader is it's very sensitive like if you like touch it like right here they will just shoot out um, it's, it looks like on the bottom you get like a little like landing gear. This is where, how you shoot all the fire, the shooters. So, that's really interesting. Uh, let, I'll show you what, what our, the coal figure that came in this set would look, look like. There we go, there's coal inside. 
Maybe make him a little more like he's actually flying. There we go. There's coal inside his rotor blaster or the rotor jet. And this thing is really long. And I really like how long this thing is. There's some gears um, on both sides. That's what activates the best thing about this set. This, the spring loader shooter. So, I can, so you can do this very quickly or very fast. I'll show you how I, I'll do it with the uh, little target which came in the set. So basically there's these uh, gears right here. That actually like turn so that's really nice. Uh, these parts can lift, can raise up. Maybe to help with a little bit of, of like landing I'm, I'm guessing. So that's really nicely done. This said, you also get a side build. Um, maybe it looks like that's a little cage for any ninja. In the on the box artwork, it shows uh, the Lloyd that were inside it. So we'll maybe put Lloyd right there, and we'll both probably give that blaster a uh, a try. Um, this actually has a really nice uh, handle um, right here. On the original, you can actually raise the handle up and down. This one doesn't. So, where I'm going to give it a quick try, you can do... Uh, there are both keys on each side, so if you're a right hand or a left hand, to make this a little bit more easier. I, that's really nicely done. So, um, give it give it a try. And these things will go far. Uh, let me... Oh, oh boy. Okay, so here we go. Boulder Blaster blasting test in three, two, one. Jesus. Oh, maybe. I'm on. Yay! We got it! It's. Hang on. Jeez. This is probably the best feature about this at that shooter. The spring loaded shooters. It's awesome. <laughs> and I was able to get the target on the first on the first attempt to save Lloyd. Speaking of Lloyd, we'll probably take a look at our figures right now. So of course we have a Lloyd. Uh uh here's Cole right here, uh, Izor, and the limited distance Golden Kai figure. Here's a look at uh, Lloyd first. This is pretty much the same Lloyd we got in with the uh, Kai Fighter, the Legacy version, which I did review. I did review. Uh, it says Master on there, um, if you can understand the Java language. I actually learned it on the internet. Uh, he has still like that nice spinning on the front. Nice spinning on the back there. There's his second inside of face and Cole and his other face. And he comes with a, well, uh, it is like blade. Next up we have a the Cole figure, this one has, is a little different from the Cole mini, from that Cole figure we got with the, uh, Ultra, the, Ultra, uh, the Thunder Raider, the Legacy version of it, is, it can have, it says Master, so this is the only way you can get the, way you can actually get this Cole in his Master uniform. Nice running on the back, some nice running on the front there. I just love the detail on these figures, how Lego would would go this far to make these different things. Uh, he has his two faces, his happy and, well, his, hang on, his grumpy face right there. Um, he does not come with any weapons, but there were some extra pieces. 
a clean sh some short so I'm gonna give him a short because well I don't want him to be weaponless when he's fighting against against Izor who is right here this is the same exact Izor we got in with the legacy versus of Jay's Electromech and the tournament elements the same figure with that same axe bone with as we got in the tournament elements nothing new about this figure but these He's a really interesting, fun guy to collect. I love that printing on the front. Nice printing on the back. And of course, I love that mohawk. <laughs> and finally, here we have the limited edition 10 years, 10 Ninjago Gears Kai. This is probably based on the Forbidden Spin Chit. You want the normal one. Uh, actually, yeah. Here's the the original. Here's the normal, like not forbidden spin jitsu one, like from season eleven. So pretty nicely done, Lego. And it looks like he uses those red studs to make his base. These golden ninja minifigures have been have been so much fun to collect. I can't believe I almost have all of them. Looks like he has a nice ring on the front. That same armor piece is used in the Zane and the Ultra Sonic Raider. Also, some nice printing on the back there. And of course, he has uh, two. Uh, hang on, let me. He has two faces: his grumpy and his happy face. So there we go. Now we'll bring back, make probably zoom out a little more. There we go. Now, so what are my final thoughts about this set? Well, this set is a blast. <laughs> uh, pun city, uh, because it's called a Boulder Blaster, and I had a blast with this. I get it. But and my thought, this is a really, but really, this is a really awesome set. I love that feature with the spring loaded shooters. There's, I really appreciate that very much. Let me. There we go. Uh, this is a really awesome set. I love this so much. And it, this is pretty close to what the original looked like. Um, I do not have the original one, so sorry guys. And. This is probably, and it is, comes with the limited edition Golden Kai figure, which is really nicely done. And yeah, and this is pretty awesome. I love this set. So, that was it guys. This was a review on the LEGO Ninjago Legacy version of the Boulder Blaster. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, turn on the notification bell, so you won't miss any more awesome videos. Thanks for watching everybody. Take care, and I'll see you next time.